Well, the circus has been a part of Peru, Indiana for more than 100 years, and this morning we're taking you inside the Big Top for a look at its history and legacy as the circus continues to inspire the kids of Miami County. The circus capital of the world. How did Peru, Indiana get that prestigious title? Well, it dates back to the 1920s and 30s when major circuses would winter here. And a lot of those people, even after the circuses moved on and Ringling Brothers bought them out, their families stayed here. Daughters, sons, grandchildren, and even great-grandchildren of famous circus performers call Miami County home to this very day. So the flying trapeze, the tightrope, the clowns, even the unicycle. It's in their blood. And with that history of talent, the Peru Amateur Circus was born. Peru Circus has been here for uh, 54 years. It is an amateur circus of Miami County kids. You have to live and go to school in Miami County. It may be called an amateur circus, but there's nothing amateur about the tricks these kids are trained to do. Somebody that's never seen just some random kid flying 20 some feet up in the air, like, it's, it's indescribable. They fly through the air, they spin, they give their heart and soul, and they do it because they love it. No payment other than the roar of the crowd. We have a secretary, a executive secretary that's paid. Everybody else is volunteer. We pretty much take the town over for 10 days in July, and the community's great. I mean, without them, we couldn't do it. Everybody pitches in. You count all the volunteers, it gets well in the thousands. From a winter home for traveling circuses to the current home of young performers aspiring to reach new heights. The Big Top is an old lumber yard, now the circus's permanent home. Peru's history takes center ring in July, and you're invited. Come to the circus and may all your days be circus days. The Peru Amateur Circus runs July 13th through the 20th. Ticket information is available on our website. And coming up tomorrow on News 18 Daybreak, I get a little taste of the rigorous training these young performers do. I mustered up the courage to learn the flying trapeze. Again, you'll see that tomorrow morning right here on News 18 Daybreak. Well, switching gears and talking about...